I was in grade seven when I realized I was all alone. I had no friends, I had no hobbies, and I had no family. The only thing I had was my console. After school, I would go home and I would sit in front of the TV. I would play my console. I would put on my favorite game and start dissociating into a fictional world. I played for long hours and I would stay up all night just playing video games. I had absolutely nothing but video games. It was only in high school when I realized that sometimes video games is not everything. Sometimes you need to explore your life a little bit more. I had just become a little bit delusional when I had start being attached to characters, fictional characters, and when I was put finally in a realistic and difficult situation, I had just realized that my favorite fictional character is not going to come and grab my hand and lead me out of the darkness into the light. My favorite character, my favorite fictional character is not going to come and tell me it's going to be alright. The only person who I had during that time to tell me everything was going to be okay or depend on or cling on was myself. And that's when I had a little slap across the face that this is the real world. My fictional character is not going to come save me. I am going to save me. I would always compare people and fictional characters and be like, oh, if that person was here, he wouldn't act like that. But in reality, there is nobody who acts like that. We're humans, and they're just fictional characters. That's it. So when I went back to playing video games, I eliminated the thought of clinginess and being sucked away in a, in a different world. I wanted to be part of the real world and I wanted par to participate in the real world. I wanted to be present and I wanted to feel alive. So now I play video games because I'm happy. Because that's something that I want to go back to to challenge myself mentally and academically and sometimes even strategically. I got into video games now because it's fun because I love it and because I get to share interest with the rest of my friends and that's why it's special to me now because I'm not only a fictional character it's also a bonding moment with the rest of the world That's why I like video games, and I deserve to be happy. <laughs>